Lori Stinson, she works in real estate, so it won't be hard for her to find a house with a bigger trophy case. She's looking for her fifth FWGA city title today. Sister, sister, Morgan and Maddie Devaji in the final group with Stinson, who holds a seven-shot lead into the final round. The Homestead pair had their chances to chip away, but a few missed putts would have made it really interesting. A group ahead, though. Sneaking up on everyone, just two shots back. Bishop Dwangergrad, Sarah Frazier rolls in the par on 17. She's currently at Dayton. And on 18, the birdie putt slides by. She posts a three under par, 69. Stinson coming up 18 with a two shot lead. She didn't know what her lead was, but it doesn't matter. She eases it in for bogey and a one shot victory for back to back city titles. I had no idea until after 18. A friend of mine said, hey, did you know um, you needed that putt to win? And I said, I had no idea because I knew where I was with Morgan and Maddie, and I didn't know about anybody else. So, um, yeah, thankfully that last putt went in. How many Fort Wayne City tournaments do you still got in you? Hopefully a lot. I feel like I'm just kind of getting back in my groove here. It actually was kind of nice because I could just fly under the radar and nobody really knew where I was at. Um, it would have definitely been more fun to be in the final group and be battling up there with her, but yeah, it's, it's awesome. She's, she's a great player. She always has been. It's nice to see that um, the game, you can play it, you can play it for, like at any age and just keep going. And um, She's a lot of fun to play with. She's so nice, so I'm really happy for her. Five and counting for Stinson, and a reminder the lefty won her first city title in 1988. And